Paul, why are we still losing shingles off the heat shield? Uh, we're, we're working with a prototype of the capsule, Al. It's literally one third the size. Of I, I get that. So, what do we do with our million dollar fan, Carl? Turn it down? No, Al, I don't it, think. It was a joke. Paul, if the heat shield comes off, what do you think happens to our astronaut? I know. So we're gonna we're gonna come up with a solve, right? Uh, yes, sir. We're working on it. Ruth, what's the status on that computer? She's right behind you, Mr. Harrison. Does she handle analytic geometry? Absolutely. And she speaks. Yes, sir, I do. Which one? Both. Geometry and speaking. Ruth, uh, get me the... You think you, uh... You think you can find me the Fernet frame for this data? Using the gram Schmidt... Fourth organization algorithm? Yes, sir. I prefer it over Euclidean coordinates. Okay, good. Good, then I'm gonna need it by the end of the day. Yes. And I'm also gonna ask you to check Mr. Stafford's math as well as others on this floor from time to time. I can, I can handle that, I'm Al. I'm sure you can, Paul. I'm sure they all can. But if that were the case, shingles wouldn't be flying off the heat shield now, would they? <laughs>